What's up, my Moon Tribe? I'm Haley, and welcome back to Moon Tribe Tarot. These are going to be general messages for whoever star sign this is for from May 5th to the 10th of 2020. So take, re re take what resonates, leave behind what does not. If you'd like to book a personal reading with me where your message is 100% correlate to your story, because um, they're for you in mind, you can find all the information how to reach me in the description box down below. Without any further ado, let's go right into it and see what's going on. From the 5th to the 10th of May 2020. So we got the... T okay. We got the Ten of Swords, we got the Eight of Cups, and then we got the Hermit. Um, this is going to be very, very, very simply done and said for some of you. You are going through the end of something. It could definitely be a relationship. It's something that you are walking away from. I say that because the Ten of Swords is this Julius Caesar. You got stabbed in the back. Somebody straight up fucking stabbed you in the back with this one. Um, I, oh god, I had a very clear, like, star sign name in my head, and I guess I'll let you know if that resonates at the end of this when we find out who it's for, um, but I have, this is a feeling of defeat. Somebody has come in Julius Caesar style and taken you out from a situation and kind of put a lot of, this person has probably betrayed you, made you feel like you were being betrayed, and now you are walking away from the situation. It's a situation that had a lot of potential. There was a lot of emotion to be harvested here. And it feels like a bitch to be walking away from this. Because you are kind of like, what the fuck? How did this happen? I don't understand how this happened or why this happened. This wasn't supposed to happen this way. It was going differently. I feel betrayed. I did not want to walk away from this. But now that this has happened, I literally have no choice but to turn and walk away because I was left with no choice. But it is that feeling of you don't, almost not having the choice in the situation where even if you would like to apologize for this person or to have them back in your life, whatever they have done right now is something that you are walking away from because they gave you no choice in the situation. The outcome is that you look inside of yourself for answers because for whatever reason, you cannot get the answers right now. This is a situation that is painful for you. It's a situation that... Honestly, this is kind of a card of healing. When the hermit goes inside of himself, he is looking for the answers to something because the situation did not make sense to you. The situation does not make sense. This person is going through the period of going out on their own and trying to make sense for themselves, trying to find the answers because the answers, the, the answers that he is getting does not make sense. So it is finding the solitude, the inner peace. This is honestly a card about really fucking caring for yourself and making yourself happy before other people do, that kind of situation. But it's also the need above all else, above all else, because nothing seems to make sense. The need to go inside of yourself to do your own shadow work is going to be the most prominent key element to all of this. This pain is over. This situation has happened. It is an ending. It is no more. Even though the pain will be residual, this has ended for you so end it for yourself all right go inside of yourself and see what you can do to um what shadow work do you need to do to heal during this time this is going to be for the star sign of oh wow i thought this was going to be for somebody else aquarius i am sorry to see this here for you this is this is painful, but honestly, the best answer in this situation is you are going to be looking inside of yourself for the answers. I don't feel like anybody else is going to be able to give you any advice or any information that you can't find within yourself. You need to do this inside yourself first. All right, Aquarius? Chin up. This is hard to see. I'm sorry to see this here for you, obviously. This, uh... I'm going through the same thing, and I'm, that's not to say, like, well, I'm going through that. Um, that's not what I meant. I just, I understand where you are, and I can empathize with that, and I'm very sorry to see this here for you, Aquarius. I'm sorry. All right, peace out. I'll see you on the flip side. Take care. I'll see you later.